Denny Hamlin and his crew celebrate in victory lane after another impressive performance here at Pocono. Won the June race from the pole, won today's race from the pole. Denny Hamlin, a two-time winner in the NASCAR Nextel Cup Series, and he's a rookie. Let's check in with Alan and Bobby Labonte. Yeah, top 10 finish for the famous 43. Bobby, how about your race? Well, it was pretty good. I mean, you know, it was uh, consistent all day. I mean, I think we run the top 12, 15, you know, most of the day. And we, car we got the car better. Todd uh, worked really hard on the tires and, and got the uh, adjustments right, you know, with the chassis and everything. Without, with limited practice, you know, we didn't really know what to expect. So uh, we worked on it all day. Never, never made any, any type of stop that we didn't work on something. And uh, spun out or didn't spin out, kind of got... 180 degree or sideways there on pit road and kind of screwed up their pit stop there and then um, got caught for speeding on pit road and exiting so that was my fault so i made two big mistakes uh there at the end i was just trying to stay stay uh, uh out of trouble not make any more mistakes but uh guys did a great job and you know as it turned out we uh, we come home eighth so it was a good top 10 for us heading to indy with a little top 10 momentum there for bobby labotti marty alan early in the race jj yaley struggled and made the car better throughout the day then four tires at the end on that call how much did that help out uh, it definitely paid off for the interstate battery chevrolet uh for whatever reason, we just couldn't get going. We started off, uh, worked on the car, made huge changes, and never really made any gains. And finally, there at last uh, last pit stop, we took four tires. Steve made a bunch of adjustments, and the car was the best it had been the entire race. So it's a good time to do it with uh, 15 laps to go. So you know, I was really trying to get to uh, Truex there to get in the top 10. But uh, 11th place finish is exactly what this team needs. So uh, a 10th, 11th, and 12th last three races, uh, we're building a little bit of momentum. How about all those Gibbs cars? All of them finishing in the top 11 today. Bill, good run for those guys. And as we look ahead to Indianapolis, boy, Denny Hamlin's name is going to shoot to the top of that list among the favorites to win there. I'll tell you one thing. It's a good thing we have a couple of weeks off because they better do some burn some men out all to catch this 11 car. So Denny Hamlin wins here at Pocono. The drama of racing continues on TNT next weekend when the Bush Series is under the lights at St. Louis. That's next Saturday night. Next on TNT on the East Coast, it's gone in 60 seconds. That's the Denny Hamlin story, just kidding. And on the West Coast, a few good men. We're out for two weeks. We'll see you at Indianapolis two weeks from today over on NBC. Denny Hamlin, the race winner here at Pocono. For our entire crew, thanks for having us in for the race, and we'll see you in two weeks from Indy. Second career win, he sweeps at Pocono.